All right, ladies and gentlemen. So to start today's lesson, what I want you to think about is what is your dream job? Take 10 seconds, think about what possible career paths you'd like to follow, and then turn to your partner, or you can do this as a whole group. Just talk about what you'd like to do. Fast forward into three, four minutes of the lesson. All right, class, so before we go any further, what I want us to do is read through the objectives together. So the first one, all together now, I can conduct research on my preferred career path. Yes, you guessed it. You will be researching the job that you were talking about or a job that you are interested in. You'll have time to work on it, I promise. Furthermore, I can communicate my ideas through clear and effective language in my presentation and when working in my group. All right. Now, I'm not going to leave you guys to your own devices. I do have an example of what you were able to do. So my dream job of teaching. All right. So first, people will be wondering how you got interested in your job. So how did I become interested in teaching? So my personal family background is that I come from a long line of teachers. My father, my aunt, my grandmother, my great grandmother, all were teachers. And this contributed to me wanting to follow in their footsteps. I saw value in education saw it as something very important that I held deep and dear to my heart. But also, I enjoyed the school environment. I enjoyed talking to others. I enjoyed seeing different perspectives that students had to offer. These were all things that contributed to me becoming a teacher. So furthermore, you might want to tell a little bit more. So. In the beginning, I really didn't like school. I was a terrible student. I would slack off, say, oh, do tomorrow. I can do it tomorrow. But a lot of my teachers showed that they cared about me. And this, over time, led me to think, hey, teaching might be something I want to do. And then once I got to college, I had to make the decision of English or history. I leaned more towards English. And I enjoyed it. I had a wonderful time studying English in college. Here I am today. And now, because I went through all of that journey, I can better understand you guys. It may not be your favorite thing, but it helps you understand people and the world a lot better through exploring different perspectives. Now, the other thing about this project is that you're going to have to look at the job description, the benefits, stuff like that, all right? So job description, what does a teacher really have to do? So for instance, they have to do their best to come to work with a positive attitude every day. It's tiring teaching, you know? You have to be up, you have to be talking to different students, adapting to the way that they like to learn things. You have to try and hold their attention for a whole 45 minutes and you have to do that eight times, five to eight times, depending on your class load, that's a lot. So that knowing their content well, planning for the day, being enthusiastic, but also you have to be available to parents and administrators, to our bosses, and to you guys. These are all things teachers have to do in addition to their normal stuff. Also, there are regular weekly meetings. There's the struggle of holding you guys' attention for a whole 45 minutes. These are all things that teachers have to do. So I want, so what you will be doing later is thinking about your duties and your jobs as well. The prompt will be posted to Power, to Google Classroom. Then benefits, you see health insurance, you see the yearly salary, you see the retirement plan, I just simply put pension plan, um, sacred personal time, vacation time, and then what abilities that 
or the ability to work with others and do something that we truly love to do. So in conclusion, there are many reasons I want to be a teacher, but I want to help others achieve their maximum potential. I want to help others achieve their academic social goals, whether that means college readiness or going on to a job or straight out of high school or trade school. These are all things that are important. And I want to make a difference to you guys in your lives. Afterwards, you will have your resources where you found all of this information. This is good to know, so then I can just double check that you didn't put down a bunch of random stuff. And then finally, if you guys are having trouble getting started, which should be trying to reflect in a moment, what do you want to do? And we're gonna dive in to do a little bit of research today. But if you wanna start planning your projects a little bit early, I do have some sentence starters of, my dream job is a mechanic. My dream job is whatever your dream job is. I want this job because, or then later on, this job works well for me because I am this adjective. Whatever you think that you are. The duties of this job include and the benefits of these jobs are. So, I gave you a sentence starter for every section of the lesson. All right? So, without further ado, let's get to work. <laughs> 